hi guys welcome back to our channel so guys today i am here relearning repracticing some of these basic maths and um, the reason for this is because i need to be able to help the kids so this is why i am learning these again um, my kids now they're going to higher grades they've been having lots of homework with maths and guys can you imagine sometimes it does take a little bit of time because you know they will get all kind of stuff fractions you know decimals you know you, you you could never know what they will be learning so you have to be prepared to to try to teach them some of these skills because um, the teachers are very smart okay they want to see how you got this answer remember guys we are in the age of um, technology you could just go and google something so the teachers want them to put their um, their workout you can't just put the answer let's say if they say 10 times 2 10 to the 20 you can't just put 20 you have to show how you get the answer okay so here we're going to be multiplying decimals so i started with this one because it's a little bit it's not easier if you don't know how to do it you're not gonna know how to do it, but this is easier so you could have an idea how to even begin okay so the first thing we're going to do is to multiply 2 by 3. We're going to, this is basically like your 1's column, okay? This is like your 1's, your 10's column, and 100's. As you could see, this is 143, so we're in the 100's column. You have the decimal point here. This is basically like 2,143, you could say that, okay? And um, there's the decimal point, so you have to always remember to add in your decimal point after you put in the the answer. Okay, after you multiply and you got your answer. So two freeze, you could um, check it out. If you don't know what two freeze is, you could go and say, okay, two four six, two freeze is six. So we're going to put six down here. Sorry guys, I'm trying to do this with one hand for you. I'm going to put the 6 down here. Then we're going to do um, 2 times 4. Okay, 2, 4, 6, 8. 2, 4 is 8. And then we're going to do 2 times 1 is 2. Then we're going to remember to line in. You have to remember to line in your decimal point so this is where you remember to add in your decimal point it has to be in line okay and then two times two is four two four okay so this is the answer right here and if you have other numbers like let's say we had 22 here you just have to take your time and multiply your ones your tens your hundreds take your time okay um so if you're not too sure how to get this done you could just practice just like some of this stuff i almost forgot how to get them done but when i went back and i learned some of them you know i got a hang back on what the answers are okay i'm going to be honest with you I did not know in school I struggled a lot with maths so I don't want my kids to do the same I did struggle a lot in maths and I did not have any help to really help me also I did not have real access to internet like that at the time um, being from the Caribbean I did not have access to a laptop really I did not have access to a phone um, so you could imagine I used to struggle a lot with math um, and I know a lot of people um, has the same issue but that doesn't mean you have to stop there okay so now we have the internet you could use it and you could go back and you could just learn um, some cool math um, um, a, a workout you know you could just do something you're never too old to to learn okay um so i hope you enjoyed this video guys have a blessed day and take care of yourself thank you for watching guys we hope that this video was helpful to someone don't forget to subscribe 
also like this video you could also share your comments or any feedbacks bye